Hello and welcome everyone. This is Mohammed Izzam from Sai Mehta Asset Coaching Center, Koti, Hyderabad. As everyone knows that a notification, a double notification already man kuchh aise nahi applications kuda start type nahi. Many of the students have already applied for the AE and as well as a double. On the other hand, guys, a notification ke intamandi prepare ho tuna. That is also a very important question. Sai Mehta Koti, Hyderabad has already started the AE coaching for civil mechanical students. Guys, AE civil wala ke specially man agar a already inko batch nadustundi but one more time we are starting a new batch guys from the coming monday onwards yes or no monday nunchi manam inko batch anedi kotta batch anedi start cheyabothunnam offline batch and as well as online batch guys those who are interested please make sure you contact onto the number which are scrolling here scrolling lo ichina number kachithanga utilize cheskondi phone cheyandi call cheyandi information gather cheyandi sir ha batches ki timings e vidhanga unnai technical e vidhanga provide chestunnaru non technical e vidhanga provide chestunnaru regarding that guys if you have any doubts call to those numbers okay let's start the class now ए विषयानी क्वेश्चन अंड आसर्स आर् आलरे बीन क्रियेटेड गई न्यू क्वेश्चन राव चाल तक उ मन को आलरे स्टाडर्ड बुक् मन क्वेश्चन उठाई कदा प्रीविय गेट का प्रीविय इंजनी सर्विस बेसीक डिप्लोमा लैवल क्वेश्चन उठाया अवे क्वेश्चन अने रिपीट अवकाश उ चूस कंडीशन फर् फ्लो टू बी रिगारड ऐस इोटेषनल फ्लो ईज इोटेषनल फ्लो की कंडीशन अने विधा उठा चूदा First of all, you need to remember some basic formulas. Irrotation. Irrotational flows means they are not going to be rotating about their own center mass. That means flow is going to be some in x direction, y direction, z direction, but it cannot be rotating about its own center. A rotating body is going to be having the angular velocity. Remember that angular velocity here it is going to become what a zero. Angular velocity here going to become what a zero. Angular velocity in the z direction is equals to zero. This is actually question from fluid kinematics. Kinematics topics की संबंधित चीना topic की संबंधित चीना question ये थी. ये rotational flows की angular velocity याने ये थी उन्नर. Angular velocity, if you see, it can also be regarded as curl of velocity vector. It's going to be represented like this. It is also equals to zero. What is it called as? Curl. Curl of velocity vector. This concept also we have. taken in fluid kinematics curl of velocity vector that is also going to become what a zero why curl of velocity vector is equals to zero because this curl of velocity vector formula is 2 times of omega z as angular velocity is itself is equals to zero then curl of velocity vector is also equal to zero this curl of velocity vector is having one more formula that is circulation acting per unit area vorticity That is also called as vorticity. These are all the condition. He any one of the condition he can ask. Vorticity is equals to zero. Vorticity formula is what? A vorticity is equals to circulation acting per unit area. Vorticity vorticity means what? Circulation acting per unit area. So circulation is also going to become what now? Zero. Circulation is equals to zero. Vorticity is equals to zero. Curl of velocity vector is equals to zero. Angular velocity is equals to zero. Okay, we can write in these conditions, guys. Sir, what is the formula for the angular velocity? Angular velocity formula. If you can remember, in the previous we talked about it. I J K U V U V W, guys. U V W. It's going to be U V W. Do by do x, do by do y, do by do z, matrix one by two outside. If I'm going to take out this row and this column is going to become eliminated. This is going to be eliminated here. The formula that we need to memorize for the angular velocity is what now? Do u by do y, do v by do x. Okay, we can write like this. Do u by do y would be equal to Do v by do x. Okay, as angular velocity is equal to zero, the determinant is also going to become zero. Then we can directly write do v u by do y is equals to do v by do x. Okay, remember this. So this is all about the conditions for angular velocity. Conditions for angular velocity equal to zero. Angular velocity is equal to zero. The flow is called as a rotational flow. 
conditions for irrotational flow angular velocity zero curl of velocity vector zero vorticity zero circulation zero and do u by do y do v by do x both are equal to each other okay observe let's observe the next question what is it mentioned here the next question given is overall efficiency mechanical efficiency hydraulic efficiency relation this is the question asked from turbines this is a question appearing appearing from where turbines concept hydraulic turbines previous ae 2016 question also sir what is the relation in between uh, overall efficiency hydraulic efficiency and mechanical efficiency this is the condition that we need to remember that is called as ohm ohm is the word that we need to remember that is overall efficiency is equals to hydraulic efficiency into mechanical efficiency this is the keyword guys that we need to remember okay what is the keyword the keyword is this one o h m okay it must be visible so let me do it with this one o h m this all three combined to form what a ohm this is three letter word we need to remember that is overall efficiency equal to hydraulic efficiency into mechanical efficiency Make sure you remember this logic so that in the examination we can solve the problem very easily. So what is mentioned there? Seventy percentage is one is seventy percentage. Ask the question is hydraulic efficiency. Hydraulic efficiency into mechanical efficiency is given how much? Eighty five percentage. Eighty five percentage. So hydraulic efficiency is going to become what? Hydraulic efficiency is equals to seventy divided by eighty five. Seventy divided by eighty five. approximate answer 0.823 something so the answer is going to become around 82.3 percentage based on the options we can verify very easily so this type of question you can solve very easily when you remember the condition that ohm overall efficiency equal to hydraulic efficiency into mechanical efficiency let's see one more question here question given is question given is very simple there try to solve this question on your own if p is the gauge pressure if p is the gauge pressure within a spherical droplet so now we are having spherical droplet is one condition okay suppose this is a droplet and uh, gauge pressure of a bubble bubble means what hollow if you cut this one you will be getting what a a filled of work piece filled thing yes or no it is filled with water is filled with water droplet droplet is filled with water okay on the other hand if we talk about uh, if you talk about a bubble if you talk about a bubble and you burst a bubble you will see that bubble is not filled it is hollow it is a hollow inside this one is hollow hollow two layers you are able to see two layers okay this one is bubble on the other hand we have this one is droplet you can solve this problem very easily when you remember the formulas for surface tension what is the formula for the surface tension i have given you three formulas one is jet one is droplet air bubble also air bubble is also filled with air and the third one is soap bubble if bubble is mentioned you need to memorize that this bubble indicates soap bubble only this bubble indicates soap bubble only okay so what are the formula sir for the jet the formula is for the change in pressure change in pressure 2 sigma by d what is the formula 2 sigma by d for a droplet and air bubble what is the formula for change in pressure change in pressure is equals to 4 sigma by d for soap bubble what is the formula for change in pressure 8 sigma by d 2 sigma by d 4 sigma by d 8 sigma by d asked the question is bubble is how many times droplet bubble is how many times droplet so what is the correct answer here 2 times is going to become the correct answer because 4 is 2 times 4 to the 8 4 2 times is going to become 8 so the correct answer is going to become 2 okay chalo pause the video and note it down guys similarly let's see one more Three we have completed, right? One, two, and three. Okay. So with this, these are the three slides, guys, that we need to remember 
for this video. With one more video, I'll come back with, uh, for you uh, with some more important questions. For until then, guys, you need to memorize that. Yes, Sai Medha Koti Hyderabad is providing the assistant engineer coaching both online and as well as offline and new batch is going to start from coming Monday onwards, okay? That is 9th of October. Don't uh, miss this opportunity because we are providing maximum con concessions those who are going to be joining from the Monday onwards, guys, okay? Thank you very much. Subscribe the channel and don't forget to press the bell icon to be notified for the further more updates. This is Mohammed Inzamam signing off. Thank you very much, guys.